<laughs> what do you reckon, Toby or Momo? Toby or Momo? Toby or Momo? Toby, Toby, Toby's head, child. Like, yeah. head. What do you reckon, Toby or Ricegum? Toby. 100%. Toby's a monster now, you know, honestly. He's a monster. You guys, like, the camera's not showing it, like, in real life, we'll have it. You're not gonna get me trouble, someone's gonna run off in the street and bang me in the head. <laughs> <laughs>Okay, let's go, straight plank. So we're warming up for chest day. How's this form? Is this all right? That's pretty good, bro. Take your bum down a little bit lower. Good, keep everything tucked in. Now, you're gonna go halfway down. Halfway down into a press up. Okay. Hold. Push up. Yeah, halfway down. Oh, Push up. Head in line. Don't lose the form, chest out. Halfway down. Up. Three press ups, let's go. Three press ups? Three press ups, let's go. One, two, three. Rest. Now, just a normal plank. Three, two, one, let's go. Good? Yeah, it's good. Okay, push onto your hands. And down again. Okay, don't slide, actually take your elbow off the floor. Push onto your hands. There we go. Now don't wiggle your bum around. And down, we're going down the other side first. Good, tuck it under, your hips have rolled out. Push onto your left hand. Push up, push up, push up. Good, rest.
we've got more reps than we've got in any other session. A bit messy, but you're getting stronger and it's good to have these days up and down totally because you're learning, right? So every day you're learning how to be better and you're not going to come in, it's just going to be perfect. That's not going to happen. Okay, at the bottom, elbows are underneath, not here and not here. So you're just going to tuck them in. Okay, this is a big mistake that people make with this exercise. That is terrible strain on your shoulder. Yeah. yeah. So elbows underneath, tuck them in a little bit. When you go to the top, straight line above your head. Straight back down, tuck your elbows back in. sure that you're not standing with it behind you yeah that's it come forward a little bit now there you go okay pull it across you across and down one squeeze that pec two see that muscle working three retract the shoulders four that's it bro squeeze it five six nice work Seven, now don't, don't straighten out the arm, keep that bend. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Nice. One, big squeeze. Two, fix the wrist on this hand. Three. Four. Squeeze, five, six, seven, eight, a little bit more of a bend, squeeze, nine, okay, bring it a little bit higher, 10, 11, 12. Now there, you start, it's the first one you started like that. Two. Good. Squeeze, four, and bring it a little bit higher now. Squeeze, five, shoulder down and back. Six. Seven. Really Squeeze it. Slide. Eight. Don't rotate. Yep. Retract the shoulders, shoulders back. Nine. 10, squeeze your pec, pump it, 11, <laughs> 12, well done bro. I felt myself rotate on that 12th one the first time, I was like, nah, I'm gonna do it again. One, now, don't rotate with it, it's just the pec. Reach out the shoulder, chest out, two. Now it should be right next to you, very close to you. Three. Open it at the bottom and then bring it very close to you on the way up. Four. That's it. You see this muscle here, this muscle here contracting, but you shouldn't be sweeping your arm out around there. Just from here, right close next to you. Five. Rest. Can't figure it out. Okay, so you're going here, you're going out and round. Okay. That's going to use, as soon as you start moving out here, it's going to put the weight out into my shoulder. We want to use that pec muscle that is looking so sticky out of you, so beautiful as a muscle. <laughs> so to use that more, we're going to open it at the bottom because it's connecting to the upper part of the arm here. So we're going to open it up at the bottom and then you're going to pull it very close to your right across. Now I've got a contraction through that pec. Take it back out, right through here. As soon as I go this way, it's just into that upper pec. As soon as I start going out this way, bring it in, the anterior deltoid. 
As soon as I get away from the body, the shoulders overwork it. Now, it's just into the pack, okay? Do you know how old Michael is? 19. No. He's four. Are you, uh, mm -hmm. in February 28th? February 29th. He's four years old. What? I've never four met one of you before. I know. <laughs> you know, this year is like, oh, it's your birthday tomorrow. And then the next day is your birthday yesterday. One. Yeah. Yeah, now just rotate your body a little bit more. There. Two. Good. Squeeze the upper pec. Now you just need to think about the elbow. The elbow definitely doesn't need to go past the collarbone, right? It's connecting from the upper arm here to here. So you don't need to take that past there. You just need to bring it into here because this is the muscle contraction that we're looking for in this area. Yeah? yeah. Shoulder down and back. Shoulder down and back even when you're practicing. Yeah, now we can see. Now, as you go up, this muscle here, yeah, that's what we're working on. Upper pec. One. Two. Three. Shoulder down and back. Four, retract your shoulders. Keep them back. Five. Trying. Get a little bit tense forwards. I don't think you're trying quite hard enough. Bring them back, chest up. There you go. There we go. You see that upper pet working nicely? Good, rest. One. Good. See that working in here? Two. Three. Four. Nice. Five. Wrist. Six. Shoulders back. Seven. Pull that elbow through. Eight. Nine. Let's move on. Three, two, one, let's go. Whoa, pause. What's that there? Hips. Hips led the way. Hold the hips up in line. There we go, let's go. Much better. One, much better press ups. Two, keep that elbow still as you push up, don't let it rock. Three, let's go. Shoulders down your back. Don't pause on the next one. Four, keep moving. Five, breathe out on the way up. Big breath in, shoulders down. Six, now the elbows are rocking, push straight into the ground. Even if you don't make it up, I prefer you stop. Pause, rest. <coughs> Um, get your hips up, get your hips up, get your hips up, come on down. Okay, let's go. Shoulders down, your back. One. Two. Nice push-ups, look at the form improving, guys. Three. Four. Five. Push, come on, Toby. Push, 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 push. Three, one, 15 good quality ones. Now remember, you stay close to the bench. Chest out, elbows a bit closer together, nice and tight. Three, two, uh, closer to the bench. Drop your back. Yep, let's go. Let's go, 15. One, you just moved away from the bench. Two. Yeah, because I was just making contact. Making yeah, that's fine. Three, it's going to save your shoulder, trust me. Four, there we go. Five, squeeze those tries. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Boom! Oh. Okay, let go. Well done, bro. Another day done. More progress, I think, in the chest session. How do you feel? Be honest. I feel slightly more confident. Once I get my alignment right, it's mainly the, it's the shoulder thing, isn't it? Yeah. My shoulders are always going too high. And I'm still very tense in the side. And once I get that right, I feel like we'll get a lot better. Do you, are you happy with your progress? Yeah. I feel slightly stronger and a bit just fitter in general. Like yesterday I played 90 minutes, no cramps or nothing. I think you're a lot fitter. What's really impressive is the fact that this has only been three and a half weeks. Yeah. I think three weeks of actual training. You've been on the bench press three times. 
three times. Even even in the comments, every single video. Oh my God, Toby's improved so much, and people are really impressed at how much you're improving. So well done, bro. You're motivating a lot of people. Leave a comment down below if this man is motivating you to go to the gym and get your own gains. And have to get them. Respect. In. My hand looks very very pale under that light. <laughs>